It's been a long time coming, but y'all know I was not going to let the month end without another check-in. So even if we had to wait until the last day of January to make it happen, we're here. So series seven, man, episodes 61 through 70. So I'm, we're going all the way back to August through October of 2021. Man, I really love this series. We honestly set some history during this series, so you'll actually hear a familiar voice because his second interview was virtual. First interview was just all audio, but we actually were able to bring back on a previous interviewee of the podcast, and he was able to talk about his nonprofit and the impact that he's making in the local communities in the Philadelphia area. So definitely check that out. But I was even able to tap in with some childhood friends in this series. I was able to tap in with some fraternity brothers. And honestly, the creativity man is truly unmatched. So as excited as I was to get this series off the ground and up and running and even excited to go back and check in with them, I hope y'all are just excited as me. So Without further ado, man, enjoy Where Are They Now? Series 7. Yo, what's good with y'all? How y'all vibing? This the one and only Sonny the Man, aka Sonny the Guy, all right? Check this out. First off, let me give a shout out to my boy Tamar. The Down to Business podcast, still doing the thing, man, going strong. Straight love for you, young guy, man. You doing your thing for real. I love it. Um, an update since the last time I was on the podcast, whenever that was, <laughs> it's been a lot going on, man. I moved to a new city. I don't have a son. Uh, I don't switch my diet. I'm vegetarian now. We've been making a lot of plays in the background and in the forefront. So I got um, events going on all year this year. Uh, start in March. We got something going on every month. And can't forget, I just dropped a new single, Godly. Make sure you go get that. Tune in. You hear my son in the background. He he said he want to hop on. Hop. Come here, Blaze. Hold on. Come. You want to talk to him? You want to talk to him? Look, look, look. Say what's up. Say what's up. This Blaze, y'all. He, he don't like me getting in the camera without him. So... <laughs> well, yeah, that's what we doing, man. Godly out right now. Make sure y'all go get that because it's real different. It's real. It help you elevate. Let's go. Down to business podcast fam. What's going on? It's me, Brendan Daly. And before I say anything, let's just take a second to thank Tamar. Tamar is, is a mega, he's a superstar, actually. And I'm grateful to be able to be here and to be able to talk to you about how things are going. So things are going really good. I moved my practice over to a new firm, actually. Um, but it wasn't by, you know, because I was trying to. It just happened because if you have enough, if you have an open mind, you have enough tolerance, you know, you can really do anything or, you know, things will happen, right? So it's about what you can give. That's what I was saying last time. So anyways, I was at, I was at a bar uh, with my sister for a birthday in Seattle City in South Jersey. Anyways, I, I struck up a conversation with this older gentleman that was sitting next to me. And, um, you know, it turns out that his son's the CEO of the Eastern uh, PA region of uh, Mass Mutual. And um, I, uh, you know, I ultimately reached out to him then and there. I was like, oh, funny thing is I'm sitting next to your dad right now, <laughs> Joe. And uh, anyway, so... I, I had a couple of interviews with them and, um, you know, I ultimately, I, I moved my practice over to Mass Mutual because like, you know, it's, it's how I want to be able to serve others better and how, you know, I'm able to do that is, you know, by helping business owners and that's, you know, what I do and that's the market that I exist in and Financial Guide LLC is, um, is my, you know, my brand and how I've rebranded and, um, what I'm doing now, but really like, at the end of the day, you know, I, you know, I think a lot of people aren't really interested in like, you know, necessarily, okay, like, well, like, you know, how or what are you doing more so like, you know, just being able to um, have an open mind can really, um, you know, create an experience that could change your life and others lives. And it's about what you can give. And that's what I said last time. So things are going really good. Find your guide LLC. This is Brendan Daly. Tomorrow. Thank you so much. And cheers, y'all. What's up, everybody? I hope that you are doing well. I'm Bernard Xavier James II, and as I sit and reflect on the sit-down and the conversation that I had with Tamar in the Down to Business podcast for the second time on the platform on October 13th, 2021, episode 70, Change the Narrative, we were discussing the launch of my new nonprofit, business, and endeavor, Philadelphia Entrepreneurial Development Academy, Philly EDA to be short. And around that time that I was discussing with Tamar, the business was about a year in and we were in the pursuit 
of submitting our application to the school district of Philadelphia to open up a charter high school. Although I regret to inform you all that on March of 2022, we got notice that our acceptance and our application was denied. That didn't stop the mission, the vision, or the purpose of the organization and what we set out to do. Since then, we provided various multiple events and programs for the city of Philadelphia, for the youth, and also the community members. We've given out scholarships and we've just gotten bigger. Um, since then, we've had our Free Your Mind event, a focus group session surrounded about the gun violence in the city of Philadelphia with the community members. We had our second annual Juneteenth pop-up shop. We had our first annual summer enrichment program um, where we had 11 um, high school students and middle school students um, come through our program. And at the end of the program, it resulted in one of our students becoming a published author. You can get his book on Amazon, I'm Just Like You by Samaj Lopez. We've had other different partnerships that we've been able to gain, one being with the Philadelphia Parks and Rec in conjunction with the Mount Airy Playground, where we are now providing night programming every Tuesday and Thursday that started this year in 2023. We just had our second annual college, high school and beyond event this past Saturday in January um, within our Life After High School initiative. So we have a lot of things in store, big things that are going to be announced and continue to follow us on the journey. And if you don't, and if you're just finding out about Philly EDA, follow us on Instagram at Philly EDA underscore, or go to our website at phillyeda.com. Be the change kid by kid.